and we're off. This is the wrap for day 01 of MB01 2023 for Friday the 6th of January. Back to Hereford. Anyway, so I started off and it was a full moon and I thought, ah, it'll be better going up on the journey and, it won't, and the full moon was no help at all, as you would expect. Rather blustery um, in the valleys to start. And in Hereford, much less blustery, um, but cooler. I'd go for the much less blustery things. Car park, not particularly full, to be perfectly honest. And coming in, um, petrol, 145.9. I filled up last week at, no, well, last week. It was earlier on this week, um, Tuesday, 149.9 in Sainsbury's in pont Preeth. Sainsbury's here for P cheaper. Who'd have thought, to be perfectly honest. Um, so, yeah, straight over to Costa. Someone had smashed their door. The whole thing was crazed, um, as in, in little pieces, but holding together. And I, I don't know if I won it, but I gained a free voucher on my app for a free hot drink for today. So I'm hoping I can have the largest cappuccino the world has ever seen. That would be my plan anyway. Um, then over to the King's Fee, which is the Weatherspoons. Open at 8 o'clock, bar opens at 9 o'clock. Um, Fruit-based drink to start as per normal. And I spend my time putting the Google Play Store on my Amazon Fire HD 8 Plus 10th Generation tablet. And it works. So I now have Gmail and Google Maps and YouTube and Upnote on there which is pretty positive and it works a treat uh, unless they change everything and it blocks it but who knows to be perfectly honest anyway um guest ales 99p a pint yeah we don't get that here in wales um minimum pricing and all that sort of stuff um but they only had two on um and the second one went off as soon as i went to try and purchase it but you know <laughs> things are like that um lunchtime over to the orange tree which is a great pubby pub it's like for people with dogs and older people and cask ale drinkers um, the cobs didn't arrive until about half 12 and i had a cheese and onion and a ham salad one and they're huge and i think i might have overdone it practically i did Checked in at the travel lodge and as I would have expected since I was up since half two in the morning and it was raining out and whatever, I just gave up and surprisingly had an early night. And the night, the night was blowing a gale and it's hammering down with rain at the moment and it's very January outside. However, the head would be a house opens at 12. So that's very positive. That was the first day. And I think I might have half finished a blog, but I can't remember. It's an age thing. Anyway, bye-bye. Where's that? You're